Okay, welcome to Double Tap. This is a pre-alpha of a game, or a game engine, that a guy named Will Graham, I think his name is Will Graham, is making. Now, this is the input configuration. This is one thing I don't like about it, it is right now, is that every time you log into the game, you have to uh, configure your settings and everything. There's no default settings, but then again, like, how can you expect anyone, everyone to have, like, an Xbox it's also pretty alpha, so I got some pretty good um, settings. Never turn on VC because that'll just turn everything to 30 FPS. It's still kind of wonky. There's a versus, there's player versus player, player versus CPU, and I'm not having a person help me out with that. So the only person you can play as is Kobe Kai. You have two costumes: the tank top and the, the fighting gi, and you have your colors, which are Ryu and Goku and Sean uh, colors much like all your different stuff. I'm going to use Ken color. And then I'm going to keep that. And then they got like four stages. Oh, whoa, whoa, there's another one. Asian Town. I don't think I've ever saw, saw that one before. They look at the same ones though. Cottage and Asian Town. You got Iceberg. You got Training Stage. The Alley. I think the Alley is probably the, the most used one. Let's go see Asian Town. I haven't seen that one. Ready. Ready. Okay, cool. Fight. So this is the first stage they had with the thing. If you go to this YouTube, you can see what it is. So the characters pretty much play like um, your standard Street Fighter. They have the Hadouken, they have the Shoryoken, they have the Tatsumaki. And then this one has, is pretty interesting. He has the Kami Kick too. Spiral. The, I think it's Spiral Arrow. And it, it's only the Roundhouse. You can't use it on the other, all the other kicks. You use it on the uh, Low Kick. It's going to give you the uh, I don't know. Now you notice that I'm kind of like uh, jittering around. Uh, the inputs are kind of uh, wonky. For my, at least for my arcade stick. The arcade stick's kind of doing its own thing. Fire. Unacceptable. Anyway, the. Uh, why is it called double tap? Well, because if you double tap one move, like you uh, say, like, show you. I can show you. Ah, no, that's not, good. that's not a good example. Let's see. Uh, I'm trying to figure out where I could. Oh wait, here we go. This move, see, see how he kind of cancels that move. If you double tap your your move, say like your Tatsumaki, you can cancel it, double tap, and it'll give you a a good opportunity to do another combo. So kind of like the, this little combo. I've been kind of fiddling around with it, so you just kind of wait. Hang on. See, it's kind of like that. See, I did hit eight hits right there using the uh, the double tap. The combo system is pretty basic, pretty basic. It took me a while to get uh, above eight hits too. The first thing you have to know is like the how the combo system works is uh, kind of similar to how like your Marvel vs. Capcom. Fair words, or like your Tekken uh, Cross Street Fighter, really. it's like low punch, medium punch, and high punch. Which are three hits. Standard three hits. Your kicks do the same thing. So, and you can mix them up like bam, 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 bam. And you can also like uh, combo uh, into like a super. They don't have like ultras or supers or whatever, but it's like this. See, six hits. It's pretty standard. And if you use the double tap mechanic correctly, you can actually cancel into like a really good, to a really good uh, combo. Kind of, uh, kind of reminiscent to um, like Killer Instinct or something like that. Let's see. Okay, the uh, chain broke it there, so. See, I did six hits right there. Unacceptable. Unacceptable. He also has that move. He also has an Akuma uh, Hadoken. So you can actually use Fire. that for combos. Like, this could be a 7 8 combo right here. 
Actually, that's a six-hit combo right there. Hang on. Fire. Let me try. Let me try to get, get that going. Still trying to learn this game. Fire. That's what I'm trying to do right there. You can see my inputs over there, so you can see Fire. where you can see where I'm doing wrong. Fire. Fire. Oh, hang on. Fire. Oh. oh, hang on. Fire. Ah, it's it's missing right there. Fire. Not, it's not reading my inputs right there. Hang on. Oh. I'm saying hang on a lot. So. But be patient. Fire. I know what I'm doing. So jump. Joking. Jump. Fire. 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 See, there's actually Fire. a lot of... Um, oh. yeah. I think this game is actually Fire. really good for those who want to... Oh. Learn like the frame Fire. frameworks. Like if, you, if Street Fighter 4 was not a uh, a good indicator of how frame works, work, this one would actually be really good. And it also has like the Fire. Roman cancel mechanic that uh, Guilty Gear has, so you can learn how to use that too. It's not the same mechanic, but it kind of works. This is the combo I tried to learn earlier. I want to try to link that together, so... Yeah. Let's see. Unacceptable. <sighs> Did it wrong. Unacceptable. Yeah. Hang on, hang on. I think I got it. Unacceptable. Yeah, I, uh, if you didn't realize, I just kind of gave up on that old, old, old combo I was trying to do. Also, if you notice, there's no EX moves. So, hang on. See, I just like I just like going into this game and just playing training mode. That's pretty much all you have. It's training mode, and offline uh, play. Not a whole lot to go by. It. Trying to link those uh, this combo yeah. with the same combo. See, see, I got eight hits right there. Yeah. Nine hits. Wow, they're really good at there. Yeah. Oh, that would've been. Ten hits. Fire. That's the first time I hit ten hits. Fire. Let's see how that works with that full bar. Yeah. Not a whole lot. It's not a whole lot of life. It feels like it should be. It kind of hit or miss. Unacceptable. Yeah. Unacceptable. It really depends on how. <clears throat> yeah, it really depends on where you're hitting it too. Unacceptable. Oh, I messed up. Unacceptable. Yeah. See, if you don't hit that uh, low kick, it's not gonna work. Yeah. Oh, hang on. I messed up. Unacceptable. Yeah. Also, when you do the double tap, it takes away a meter. So you gotta watch out. 
Do ten hit combos. Yeah. Oh, I messed up. Yeah. It's all about the canceling and the. Uh... Yeah. It's all about canceling and then, uh, finding the frame links. I wonder if I can Fire. actually. Do it. This is this is fun. Yeah, you can actually. Yeah, 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 that's possible. Yeah, it's possible to actually do that, but it doesn't combo into anything. I don't think the double taps don't actually combo into yeah. each other. See, that's actually a two-hit combo, but they don't actually combo into each other. See, it combos into that, so so you can actually just do this. You have to actually like really wait for your frames to hit. This is way more frame like frame link heavy than uh, Street Fighter 4 is. Or I should say it's about the same. That is a. Uh, I wonder. Nope, I did it wrong. Ah. Nope. Oh well. Let me end with another. Uh, I gotta do it without him having in the corner. Unacceptable death. Cause it's more impressive when you're not doing it. Unacceptable death. <sighs> Unacceptable death. Ah man, I keep up loving it up. Oh, maybe I can cross off it. I can make it a cross up com uh, combo. Oh, that's a five hit. Unacceptable. Ah, oh, messed up. That was it. Hang on. I want to do a cross up. Ah, oh, that was seven hits. Come on. Something didn't change. There we go. All right, we're done with that. So that's Double Tap. Double Tap is a pretty cool game. You can check it out with the uh, with their um, uh, big website and all that. Uh, yeah, give it a try. You might like it. Find a friend. 
play play together get your arcade sticks it's really good um i don't know when the full game's out it's pre-alpha the guy probably doesn't have uh anything else after pre-alpha so yeah uh take care guys and i'll see you on the next video